welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited to be finally vlogging with you guys again. I took a very, very long break. I went on vacation and it was really hard to get back to filming and vlogging with you guys just because the first week I was very jet lagged. And then week two, I was very sick and I'm finally feeling myself again. So I wanna do a little reset vlog with you guys. Um, as you guys can tell, I still sound congested, so <clears throat> bear with me, but we got some Starbies. I got myself a pink drink because it's so hot. I'm gonna head to get a car wash first and then head to Trader Joe's. I feel like those two things are top of my list right now. The car is very dirty and I wanna get some things for dinner and snacks and then just kind of reset the house. So getting myself back on track, a little reset routine is very much needed after going on vacation. So I'm very excited to be filming and vlogging with you guys today. I'm very sorry I didn't post for a long time, but I'm back and I'm planning to post back again two to three times a week. Uh, yeah, let's head out. I think I'm gonna head straight to the car wash right now and then we'll go to Trader Joe's and see what we find. But yeah, guys, so sorry. We're back and better, hopefully. <laughs> I got, oh, I didn't even notice I got different ones. <laughs> I got the chicken noodle soup and then the pork and ginger. Don't know if these will be good, but I'm gonna try them out. And then I got salmon for tonight to make a salmon bowl. Also have been craving the sriracha. I haven't gotten it in so long. And right now sriracha is like out of stock everywhere. So it's kind of perfect because I really love this one. It's super good. It tastes very different than the original like popular sriracha but it's delicious and then got some sweet potato gnocchi this is so good during the fall but I was craving it so got myself a bag got this big old cucumber for my salmon bowl tonight lastly see it wasn't much I got my uh, chili onion crunch this I have to have it in stock at my house at all times and I haven't had it in months so happy I got it it's pretty much everything I got it wasn't anything crazy but really delicious things I probably I'm probably gonna come back and get snacks at some point but I just kind of want to get the basics right now um, but now I'm gonna head home I really want to do a reset in my house do some laundry and things like that and kind of organize my week in my planner so we're gonna head back and I still have my Starbucks surprisingly still has ice so let's head back
sweaty now like i could see my face getting very oily but i finally got through all the hair in the house there was so much fur olive and pepper shedding like crazy so that was like the main thing i really wanted to do threw in some laundry got rid of the fur on the couch look at how nice my living room looks right now I like love it i haven't showed you guys i think that i got this new tree i still need to get a pot for it but um so far i'm almost done i just need to do some mopping and cleaning my mirror dusting it and then watering my plants i've been neglecting them too since i went on vacation so um yeah and then also i threw in some dumplings to have a midday snack slash lunch so i'm very excited to have that right now but we're almost done and then i need to get back to organizing and planning my week Excuse the washer, it's still going, but I wanted to show you guys my skincare routine I've been doing lately. I'm slowly transitioning into Korean skincare products because I feel like that's just like the best way to go. Now I don't know why I didn't do it earlier, but this is still the cleanser I use, the La, La Roche Posay Hydrating Gentle Cleanser. This is like a really nice basic everyday cleanser. I've been really liking it. Um, but for the products I am using, everything's like very kind of like new to me. These are mainly the new products I've been using. So these are basically the same thing. So these are basically the same thing. I didn't realize these are both heart leaf toner. So this is just in liquid form and this is in pads. These are supposed to be just so gentle on the skin and just kind of like reduce redness. The nice thing about the pads is that you can like leave them on certain spots let's say you're breaking out so i really like these i love the packaging and i really like this toner too so i've been using this in the daytime this kind of in the night just kind of switching them around and then i've also been trying out this dermalogica daily micro exfoliant this paired up with this really just gets your makeup looking smooth it exfoliates your skin and it's like really nice for an everyday wear so that's that but for my other korean um skincare products so this was really recommended on tiktok this is the vitamin c dark spot serum i've been using this instead of the regular um vitamin c serum just because i think this is going to be a lot better so i've been testing this out i still don't know how i feel about everything but i have high expectations and then this is the moisturizer I've been using. This is the Soon Jung the Two Times Barrier Intensive Cream. I've been really looking for a really good moisturizer and like I said, Korean 
skincare is the way to go so i've been testing this out i'll have everything linked down below so you guys can check it out for yourselves if you want but this is how i've been using the cleanser so i got the little trial size from ulta i put a little bit like that and then i just do maybe like one or two pumps and then just mix it together and it kind of just creates this nice exfoliating wash and it's like very gentle where you can use it every day but specifically right before makeup it just like helps your makeup apply really smooth and nice i'm gonna go in with my toner pads i think i'm gonna use these tonight so it comes in this cool packaging where it comes with the little you know things to pick it up so you don't have to contaminate all the little pads and they're very thin like very fine so you have to be careful when you pull it out it looks like this you either just like leave it on if you have a pimple but i just use it all over my face and then i kind of like to just rub it around the specific areas that are red for me so around my nose but but yeah, just like everywhere. 